What's up everybody, what's up Imuna Nation? So, uh, I wanted to talk in a video about something that I think comes up with people sometimes when uh, when they come to to learn thing, learn like Torah or things like that. Really, yeah, really when they come to learn and they open the Bible and and uh, start learning or they read articles online is they especially people people starting out to come to this path people who have been searching for a while and now maybe they're on to um, on to they found the wisdom of Torah and they found like Kabbalah they found sources of Kabbalah and they're kind of interested in it they uh, they 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 find these articles and in Bible and they can open the Bible and and uh, basically, they make it. They make the mistake of thinking that they know what it's talking about. Uh, and I know this because because it was definitely me when I first started out. I opened the Bible and I was reading the Bible and I was making all these connections between this and that and and like this is really is is also is it like talking about that and, and I'm trying to think of an example, but like like let's say like a I was thinking of an example like a nation of uh, of Amalek or or another or another nation mentioned in the Bible I was thinking like that that I was making assumptions basically basically and what it is is assumptions is we assume we can assume that we know what the Bible is talking about or what Kabbalah is talking about like when we read when we read things and and one of the huge gifts I believe that I learned is basically that I don't know what I'm talking about. That uh, that uh, it's just it's just basically like nonsense that uh, that I had in my brain from all YouTube videos from from equally crazy people talking about this and that and and you can find online hundreds of people with hundreds of opinions and it's uh, and like hardly any of them know what they're talking about and. Uh, and I don't know. I just when I found Rav Dror, when I started listening to Rav Dror's classes, I uh, I felt like he found something that that uh, that I didn't hear other people talking about. I didn't hear other people talking like that. Yes, I found this. I found that. That this is possible. That that is possible. I thought that that this that this sort of spirituality was only possible like. In the, from with Kabbalists or in the old days, hundreds of years ago, Kabbalists were able to to be spiritual or whatever. So Rav Dor was the first person that I heard who was saying like like that it's real and that it's uh, available and and uh, and it really just opened my mind to believe that the things that I desired were possible. And uh, so. So that's why how I was able to to learn and and to learn and just basically like open up to listen to what Rav Dor was saying and like trying to understand it. And if I think about it, like all the things that I could say like that I and it's not like a lot of things, but the things that I could say that I really understand in the in the Torah that I really can like feel like I can say that I really understand what it's talking about on some level. Uh, on some level, all those things are just what I basically what I learned from Ravdor that that I really listened to him enough and tried to hear what he was understanding and and whatever to where I could get it, and I realized that I was so full of like nonsense, like I was so I thought I knew what I was talking about, but it's uh, it's it's uh, it's mental like nonsense, like there's nothing to it. So, uh, so I wanted to make this video to, to basically let people know that uh, that if you want to find real results, if you want to find uh, real results, sometimes you have to realize that that you're not so you're not as wise as you thought you were, and and really that you you really don't know that you think you know, but but all that you think you know or the conclusions that you made, you can. You can check them if they're if they're uh, if they're assumptions, and for sure there are people have people have come to right conclusions and people 
do know what they're talking about, but what I've found, the things that I know what I'm talking about are, are what I learned from Rav Dror, and I was able to apply what I learned from my teacher. And um, I think that's important. So, uh, I hope everybody has a good day. And, uh, and it's also, I also wanted to say, it's a humbling thing to realize you don't know what you're talking about, to realize that, wow, I was full of nonsense. I was, I was, sh and I was, I was teaching other people and I was explaining to other people, but really I'm so wrong and, and it's a really humbling thing. But, but uh, if you want to come to the truth, if you want to come to just, just the truth, you have to be honest. So everybody have a wonderful day and uh, hope everybody is well. Bye.